Hi guys, I am back with another video, and today's probably the day where we find Skeletron. I managed to find the dungeon. The dungeon is... Dungeon, and then I went down a bit because around there's where the dungeon guardian got me. Anyway, um, I managed to get a space gun, which goes like this. A face saver, which is still not as good, but I love it. Oh, sorry, bunnies, but I love the sound it makes. Womp womp. And a masterful water bolt. So, Skeletron might be okay, actually. So, oh yeah, and also the meteor ham axe. I really like the face saver because it's an auto swing. Or no, it's not. Actually, never mind. <laughs> this is where the meteorite was. So, I'm on the way to the dungeon. I'm at the corruption now. That is a lot of sand. Wow. And here we go. There we go, so this is where the fight with Skeltron is going to be taking place. Nice, I got a whole bunch of potions. I won't do it tonight, because it's already 12, and that means I would have about 4 minutes. No. I think I might do this tonight. Yeah, that's one hand.
Yeah, okay, so the bee's knees is just too overpowered. And nice. Now let's go explore the dungeon. Yep, there's a chest here that I have not checked out. I'm mainly looking for the Muramasa. But anything else is cool. Okay. That was not supposed to happen. Um. Okay, that was not supposed to happen. But hey, I have a golden key and I want to go home before it's too late. And I want to keep that and that. I can put everything else away. I want to keep the space gun and the book of skulls. And then of course the golden key. Once it gets daytime, everything will be a bit easier. Yes, I love when the desert is facing, it's going the way you want it to. It's really useful when you're trying to travel in the same direction as the wind's blowing. But if you're going the opposite direction, you might as well either use a rod of discord or give up. Because it's really hard. Okay, so it's almost daytime, and I am back at the dungeon. Skeletron was not that hard. Wall of flesh, the wall of flesh will be though. And I know that for a fact. I'm now in the dungeon. And I know I am, s and I know I'm safe because dungeon guardians are not coming after me. If I can get the Muramasa off the first chest, that would be great. Wow. Oh yeah, and I guess I don't really need recall potions anymore. I'm gonna keep exploring the dungeon, just cause why not. Yes! And that's why. Okay, mechanic. Mechanic, I will build you a house. What the heck? Okay, I need to build a mechanic a house now. Now, now, now. Worry about that stuff later. Um, wood. Okay, mechanic, um, this is just a temporary house. Mechanic will be living in the dungeon or on the floating island. Um, I 
the trip to the dungeon was shorter than I expected, but I get the mechanic. Okay, come on, mechanic. Okay, now I'm gonna go to the floating island, build the mechanic a home, like a proper home. The mechanic can live here. Sorry about that. So I'll make the mechanic a house. So, I think this is a proper host for the mechanic to live in. Okay, the mechanic is safe. And then I have another house for someone who wants to move in. Hopefully the alchemist. Sweet. Now, that'll be the end of this video. Um, bye.